A lot of times I'll be in a 200 mile run or something like that, and I'm all jacked up. Body's broken, mind's broken, spirit's broken. I start to say, what if I can pull this off? When I first walked into the Navy SEAL recruiter's office, he looked at me and said, there's only been 35 African Americans in 70 years make it through. You know what I said to myself? What if I can be the 36th? That there's a, a place where we can go within ourselves. There are things that we can accomplish, things that we can do that eye has not seen, ear has not heard, nor has entered the heart of mankind what God has in store for us. When we surrender life to me, when you're pursuing your greatness, you find something that you love, that you surrender to that, that that something gives you life, hmm. and that you turn yourself over to that and allow yourself to be used by life. It's the what if I can pull off a fucking miracle. What if I can become someone that no one thinks I can be? And just that, just me talking about that, I have the hair going up on my arms because it makes me just like, what if I can be that guy that people who call nigger and this and that, and now I'm speaking at Tom Ferry's fucking event. Because, yeah, nothing changes and nothing changes, man. You know, we'll sit around forever wondering, well, what if I... I just want to remind you because, you know, I've spent a lot of time in my life sitting around wanting things to change. Um, and not being able to make them change and, and not thinking I could. That in order for something to change, there needs to be change. 